everybody. So Tropical Storm Earl hit here yesterday and came through. I was kind of nervous because we hadn't finished pruning trees around our property. And my biggest fear was, oh my goodness, what if one of the trees come down? Because in the last tropical storm, our neighbor across the road and our neighbor next door, trees fell down on their property and completely like kaboom, fell. Oh my goodness. And I was like, I don't want that happening here. Thankfully, it wasn't so bad for us. But my fear was the power would go because the last tropical storm, the power went. My fear was, like I said earlier, that trees would fall down, but they didn't. We just had a few branches and the fence. But before I get into that, Yesterday, we did pick up some odds and ends at the supermarket. All right, I just got a few things picked up. I got some a and root beer. Ended up picking up these single drapery bracket sets for our curtains in the front window. Some Clorox disinfectant wipes. Ims puppy chow. Some orange Gatorade. Chips Ahoy cookies. The vegan cheese flavor dog treats, a large bag of those. Boots for my husband, rubber boots, especially with all the rain we're starting to get now. I figured he needed a new pair, so I ended up getting these for him. And I also like the fact they have the jaw, dra the draw string at the top to tighten them. Some Kit Kat chunky chocolate bars and Hershey's cookies and cream chocolate bars. I let the dogs out when there were breaks in the weather. There was still a bit of high winds, but the rain and stuff ended up slacking off a lot, which was really good. So I would let them out to play. The first time I let them outside, I noticed a giant branch from our maple tree was on our patio. And I was like, okay, well. <laughs> yeah, I was about to let the dogs out to use and we're in the middle of a tropical storm here. And uh-oh, <laughs> one of the branches came off of the tree. And you can see the barbecue, the side part there that you can lay stuff on. That's all flipped up. I think that's only a quick and easy fix though. Hopefully it's not broken or snapped off. But ah, we got the tree branch in the backyard. But no, there's a tree branch. But it's quite windy out. I'm gonna open the door here now and let them out. Careful. Ah! Lost the door there. Come on. It's okay. Claire's like, what? Are you gonna go, Claire? It's okay. You can go, pretty girl. Come on. It's okay. It's okay. Mommy's gonna keep an eye on you. It's okay. Claire. Come on. You want me to go with you? Here. <laughs>
I was saying to myself, I hope that's the worst of it. <laughs> and then I let them out again shortly later and I noticed that the fence, the fence ended up falling, which doesn't surprise me. It's just lattice that we got just slapped up there for now until we actually go to replace it with a brand new fence. That was fell down, but besides that, in terms of damage and destruction on the property, some leaves around, that branch and the fence, oh, okay. There we go. getting the dogs a few things at PetSmart just because they were being so well behaved and I know the storm was kind of like rattling to them. I'm getting their favorite, oh, upside down, their favorite bones, the past bones. And there's three of them. They absolutely love these. I also picked them up this rope toy from one of my favorite dog toy brands. And it is the Joyhound brand. We'll see how long this lasts. The other ones have been holding up pretty well, so I'm curious about this one. I also got the dogs two bags of treats, the Purina Beggin Mini with bacon and the Milk Bone Soft and Chew Steak and Cheese flavor. Jersey needed more Pampers, so I ended up grabbing him some of these. The Top Paw 12 count disposable mail wraps. As some of you might know and not know, he hasn't been doing very well. He's been quite sick and he's been kind of a roller coaster. Some days he's doing really well and he's eating and drinking, and then those other days he's just sleeping, not wanting to eat, not wanting to drink. And like the vet said, with what's happening to him, we just have to ride it out, take it day by day, just keep an eye on him, just keep trying to encourage him to eat and drink, make sure he's just going out for his bathroom breaks, things of that nature. That's what we just have been doing. Me and my husband, we're just taking it day by day and just doing whatever we can that's best for him. And last but not least, I needed to pick up more flea and tick treatment. I ran out, I ended up having all the dogs done except Claire and Keenar. Do you like that toy? Yeah. You guys seem to really love this Joyhound brand. So far, there was only one toy that the Joyhound brand had. It was like a stuffy snake. I showed it in a previous video. They completely destroyed that. So far, all the rope toys, they've been doing pretty good with in terms of not completely destroying them. Hey, buddy. What do you think? And of course, Ariel got one of those bones that I picked up. That doesn't surprise me. She absolutely loves them. <laughs> Your toys. But thank you so much for watching. That is everything for this video. Tropical Storm Earl, thankfully, wasn't so bad here on the island. And I'll see you all real soon for another video. Bye now.